We are in Hakumba Hot Springs, California. Thousands of migrants are living in squalid conditions in the Southern California desert. Migrant crossings in December shattered all previous records. Oh my God. Oh. Oh, oh, shit. Vamos, hey, agarramos panocha! We're being treated as if we're a bunch of buffoons out here, which I take exception to. Right. I see a potential, like, in making this kind of the migrant Coachella. We don't know exactly where these camps are right now, but Leo looks like he's dressed to do some searching. Mm. And Mudflap, you're dressed to do some delivering of happiness. I got beer and toys for all the good girls and boys. I'm in the mood for some humanitarian beef. Yeah. If there are other humanitarians that are like, oh, we're Red Cross, we're licensed to be here, I'll be like, oh yeah? Lick it. Yeah, that's right. Lick it. I'll tell you what, I'm not gonna check any IDs either. I'm giving beers to everyone. Dude, the things they've seen, their spiritual age is like 48. Thank you. Even if they're 10. Oh my God. Oh. Oh. Oh my God. Dude, Nico. Oh, oh. shit. Oh, this is real, dude. What the f No! Oh, <laughs> That's Danny Mullen! Yeah. Dude, I don't know just watch you guys. Do. No. Like, keep an eye on us. We need your. What's <laughs> up, Matt? Are you army? Is this legit? Oh wow, we we got a guardsman on our side. Thanks for keeping us safe, brother. I appreciate you. This is my battle Hamilton right here. Hey Hamilton! A cousin of yours. YouTuber. They go around. They do awesome YouTube videos. They cause havoc. They get drunk. They make fun of their cameramen. You know. Yeah, we do. All dick meet Nico. Martin, we just tried to get the gentleman of the buses up there to arrest him about five minutes ago for having a small okay. dick. If you guys are itching to take a little dicked cameraman into custody, we can help you with that too. Yes! Welcome to America. Oh, uh, water, he wants water. There we go, Respond. This guy's gonna get ahead. This was a trick. Based on which one you choose, the water. This predicts income right here. 165 grand annually. Within three years, he's gonna be making it. Watch that. Yeah, another one. Thank you. Another programmer. Thank you, man. You guys made my day. Like usually, I'm, I'm the bad cop. That's good cop. Yeah. But. Well, uh, Martin and Hamilton, you guys want to sit down a migrant, do the good cop, bad cop routine right now? Uh, we can't do that. We, we can't. We have no hands-on with them. We're just here supporting Border Patrol. Sure. Due to what we call OPSEC, operational security, we can't uh, go into too much detail. Yeah. But um, we're thankful because we were. We're here. We're here just supporting Border Patrol. Uh, we just kind of do what they say, and uh, we're here to keep them safe and make sure that uh, none of these migrants get a little too feisty on them. You know what I mean? Sure. You know what? You know what we could do if you guys want to set an example. We could pretend, because Leo is Argentinian, we could be like, hey, this is a migrant, he just come over the border and you just backhand Leo. Dude, dude. I don't have my ID, backhand dude. I don't want to get Leo. stuck over there. I don't have my ID right now. God damn it, dude. Yeah, yeah. I, would, I would have to call Sarge up here yeah. to get permission to backhand right Leo. Right to to backhand Leo, this obvious? Is this Sarge? Oh, Can we ask him? I'll talk to Sarge. How's it going, Sarge? Uh, Sergeant, I just want to say this right now. What we told him earlier is all baloney. My cameraman's from Ecuador and my partner over there is from Argentina. I'm not sure if they have their papers. I want you to take them off my hands. It's a troll if, channel. So it's if you could give them a one-way bus ticket to the center of South America, that would be Danny, great. Danny, you said that we have a job with you. <laughs> oh, man. Damn, dude. You know, I think we need to break the ice right now. Okay. Sort of like a stand-up comedy performance. I think you go in, you hit them with your best material in Espanol. Como estamos, señores? Como están? Vamos, hey, agarramos panocha! Yeah! Oh, y también te quería decir otra cosa. Él tiene un pene pequeño. Sorry, yeah, yeah, sure. I'll go talk to them for sure. Thank, Thank you, you, man. Appreciate you, sir. Just remember. That's cute. For you. Now, the little girl, give her a troll. Give her a troll for her. There we go. Troll for you. Oh, ho, ho. This is sad. This is really sad. Can I say a beer? Say perdón. The beers. Hey, you want a tech deck or a beer? What do you want? A beer? Oh, you want both? I'm in. Yeah, yeah. That's alone. We got a lot of ladies lined up over here. This is the most female-heavy migrant detention situation we've seen thus far, and that can only mean one thing, Nico. 
The Danny Mullen has to get sharp. Which one said I was poor? ¿Quién dijo que era el era pobre? ¿Quién dijo que era seco? That's no dinero. <laughs> was it you? Hey, that one said yeah. I was poor. <laughs> <laughs> Tell him uh -huh. that I have a that I have a house. Él tiene una casa so in Beverly Hills. In Beverly Hills. Uh -huh. Actually, it's in Tarzana. Bueno, es en Tarzana. Estaba mintiendo. No es en Beverly Hills. Es en Tarzana. It's actually in Bakersfield. Okay, estaba mintiendo. Es en, es en Bakersfield que no es mucho mejor que esta área acá. Es, es bastante feo. En, en la casa no es muy buena. Tell him I'm crashing on my uncle's house. It's actually in Winnemucca, Nevada. Está viviendo con su familia porque no tiene plata. Y está muy pobre. Igual que nosotros, estamos pobres. He said, just like her and everybody else here. So, Damn it. Welcome to the club, they said. All right, dude, so you won. So you called me out. Do you feel like a big He's man? Right. He's offering you, you feel money, like a big bro. Man? The guy's offering you money. That guy's dude. offering me money. <laughs> 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 Thank, Thank you, man. Make it rain. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We've got the, hi, oh, I'm telling you, this is the, you know, I got a soft spot for Asian women, Leo. Hi, uh, hi. Well, um, how are you? Are you interested in having a, a great life with, uh, with an American gentleman like him? Yeah? Do you, uh, do you think he is handsome? Handsome? Do you think he's nice looking, you know? Take your, hat, take your glasses off. Remove the pith helmet? I think so, I think so. You have to see, you know, look into his eyes, you know. You are looking for a husband? You know, easy life, no work. Ever since the car accident, I've had crossed eyes, but I got a good neurosurgeon's number in San Diego. We're gonna get it worked out real soon. They're gonna change that. It's not always going to be like that. Right now, he is ugly. He's very ugly. Your friends will make fun of you, but eventually when he gets his eyes fixed, he, you will have the last laugh. Thank you. What, uh, okay. what airport did you fly into? South America, Central America. You fly from China? Turkey. Okay, so China to Japan, Japan to Turkey. Turkey to Mexico. Turkey to Mexico. I know a travel agent in San Diego too. Could have got you a direct flight to Turkey. You didn't have to stop in Japan. And now a word from an impoverished migrant who made it to Los Angeles. Sponsored by FanDuel. Happy Super Bowl season to all of you from FanDuel, America's number one sports book. That's right. Fez here, my Latin American friend. His English isn't so great. Yeah, it's nice. Sucks boss. What's your country of origin? Nicaragua. Nicaragua, and you came here illegally? Yes, illegally. Transported up through a little bridge in Mexico. Super Bowl Sunday is just around the corner. I guess for you, every day is pretty much Super Bowl Sunday, though, because you don't have a job. To me, yes. I'm going to tell you what I like to do on Super Bowl Sunday. I like to lock in on the couch, I like to stuff my face with red meat, and I like to make some wild, wild bets. So Fez, you know who's playing in the Super Bowl? I don't know. Uh, the, the, the brothers, the, the, the famous Come on, one. dude, the brothers? Yeah, I You're gonna get a racial on a fan duel ad? What? I got two grand that Patrick Mahomes is gonna link up with Travis Kelsey for two TDs through the air. Go out for a pass. If you think my bet is stupid, that's fine. FanDuel has so many ways for you to end the season with a W. Not only can you bet on who will win Super Bowl 58, FanDuel has bets for... Which player will score TD? How many points will be scored? And so much more. New customers join today and you'll get $200 worth of bonus bets if your first bet of five or more dollars wins. Just visit fanduel.com slash Danny to sign up. Hi! Make every moment more of a FanDuel. An official sportsbook partner of the NFL. Must be 21 plus and present in select states. FanDuel is offering online sports wagering in Kansas. Under an agreement with Kansas Star Casino, LLC. $10 first deposit required. Bonus issued as non-withdrawable bonus bets that expire seven days after receipt. See terms at sportsbook.fanduel.com. Gambling problem? Call 1-800-GAMBLE or visit fanduel.com slash RG. In Colorado, Iowa, Michigan, New Jersey, Ohio, Pennsylvania, Illinois, Kentucky, Tennessee, Virginia, and Vermont. Call 1-800-NEXT-STEP or text next step to 53342 in Arizona. 1-888-789. 7777 or visit ccp.org slash chat in Connecticut 1-800-9 with it in Indiana 1-800-522-4700 or visit ksgamblinghelp.com in Kansas 1-877-770-STOP in Louisiana visit mdgamblinghelp.org in Maryland visit 1-800-gambler.net in West Virginia or call 1-800-522-4700 in Wyoming hope is here visit gamblinghelplinema.org or call 800-327-5050 for 24-7 support in Massachusetts or call 1-877-8-HOPE-NEW-YORK or text HOPE Hope and why in New York.
Wow, you guys came a little bit more prepared than us, I will be honest, or our supplies are exhausted. You guys love being the favorites, don't you? You always yeah. love taking the limelight away from guys like us. The golden children of the border. Yeah. Congratulations. Los Angeles. Oh, what do you think? This, he, well, he's from Ecuador. We're trying to get him sent the other way, actually. Yeah, uh, he doesn't speak English. Sorry about that. He's got about as much value to us as one of these dogs. That's a, actually, that's a cute Labrador. I'm sorry, Nico. I'll take that dog over you six days out of seven days of the week. What do you guys, uh, what do you guys got for him today? Peanut butter and jelly sandwiches? Or are we talking, or we got some protein, some real protein? Wow. Dude, I feel like, I mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, we're getting outshined in the humanitarian department, dude. Pasta? <sighs> hot, which organization? The North Pole, what do you think? You guys have a little van full of stuff helping them. I help everybody every night for one night a year. Help yourself one night a year by eating a salad. <laughs> I get them with the fat so jokes sometimes, you know. You know, you know. You gotta get them with the... We're also the HR department, so he can't really complain. He can't do anything. It's, he's tried once and I just said, suck my dick. <laughs> yeah. Hello, everybody. Getting some shelters up. That's awesome. Are you using a level, right? You're not just eyeballing it. Make sure you use a level, my man. Just saying. I know this is all very ad hoc, but a level would still be very much appreciated. Use a level. You using a level? He, he, maybe he speaks Spanish. Señor, uh, hablas español? No, I, I think he's just a regular. Yeah. He's locked in. I'm telling you, dude. Yeah. He's listening to Jocko Willing's podcast. He's just. <laughs> 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 I got help today. Who are you guys with? If we don't, if you don't mind us asking. Um, we're with Borderlands Relief Collective. Oh. He just gave you the choke sign. Well, come on, man. Now you got to own up to why you don't want her to talk to us. We're just having fun documented this experience. This is awesome. We're being treated as if we're a bunch of buffoons out here, which yeah. I take exception to. Right. We're trying to help. And I, I see a potential like in making this kind of the migrant Coachella. You know, we need a DJ here. Can anyone get a DJ here? Oh, you're funny. What? 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 I'm being serious, man. I just want to lift morale. You know what I mean? That's what we do. We lift morale. Leo, this guy, he doesn't seem to like you very much. He's filming you. He also, he clowned you on the Coachella. He doesn't like your idea. It started because we, he doesn't use a level when he's constructing some, you know, look, look at this job. He obviously didn't do it with a level. I mean, with a level, it looks much better than that. I see exposed nails on that crate right there, dude. It's dangerous, man. There's kids here. That's a tetanus hazard. And that's on you. Was it so horrible that I suggested a DJ? Is that, is that horrific? Well, I hear music playing from over there, as me thinks. Not such a shitty idea after all, huh, man? Yeah. Not such a shitty idea after all. <laughs> all right, well, I think that's good. You know, Leo, if we come underprepared, yeah. we can compensate by being overly aggressive. <laughs> I think that's what we can do. And I think we've done a good job of that. A little salsa, dude. Come on, dude. You fall, now you're just being unproductive. Now they're going to fire you from the job because you're slacking. You're getting paid hourly right now, and you're spending 30 minutes following us around with an iPhone. We've done way, look at him shaking. He's shaking. Dude, he's, an, he's from Ecuador. We gave away beer and toys. All you guys do is... He's possibly undocumented. And what, you're going to blow him up to the internet like that? That's f***ed up, man. Tell them in Spanish that um, <laughs> this guy might have a tiny, you know. Hit it, dude. Big. Go big, Leo. Señoras y señoras. Get everybody's attention. Everybody. Todos. Uh, este aquí con la máscara tiene un pene pequeño. <laughs> I got to laugh, dude. Well, I think your time here is short now. Your days are numbered at this facility because he just told everybody you got a small penis, buddy. He just told everybody that shit. Don't worry about it. I got over that rumor in middle school. It happened to me in middle school, and it took me about... 17 years before people kind of forgot about it. I'm but, still getting over that rumor. Yeah, but it's okay, man. You'll be fine. How's it going, guys? Mandarin? China? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You speak Mandarin? Okay, okay. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, you speak English? Yeah, that's cool. Oh, do you want to translate? So I want to say this right now. I know there are tensions between our two great nations, but right yeah. now I'm prepared to make a concession. Yeah. China can have Taiwan. I'm giving that to you. Go ahead. You can have Taiwan, but in exchange, I want free orange chicken at the Lucky Dragon on Greenback Lane in Sacramento for the rest of my life. Okay? It's good. Oh. You can have Taiwan. I don't care if the chips start costing three times as much. Do you want, what about white rice with it though? Can we add the white rice with it? Or do you want just, oh, just my the God. chicken without the white rice? Oh. If they can give me the white rice, they can have Japan too. 
Were you, was any of that translatable? I think all he got, he looked me in my eyes and he said, do you have more beer? So I don't think- Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I, welcome, man. Welcome, man. Oh, no, yeah, we're happy yeah. to have you guys here. Can I, we take a selfie with them? That'd be and, great and I'm rooting for you guys to take Taiwan too, dude. Selfie with the, with the, the our brothers. Oh, yeah. 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 Wow, dude, that's, that's your wife. Who are we? Yeah. Wait, Neeks, one second. Are you rolling a- I'm rolling 10 uh, 4K now, so. Um, let me pose it to you. Who are you? No, I'm asking you all first. Hi. Hi. Well, I'm uh, sending it right back your way, Zs. Who are you? This is an interesting Hi. way to flirt. I'll say yeah. that much. All right. This is cute. So my name's Teresa. Nice what are you. y'all's names? My Leo. name is uh. Mm -hmm. My name's none of your business. My name's Fan Jerry. You know, we're just trying to help people out here. So are we. So and I think per capita, we gave out more beer than your operation. That's so true. tisk tisk. Tisk, tisk. Right. People seem like they needed a beer. And, uh, so I, you know, I just have to say that we're just trying to make sure people are fed and clothed and given some water. Oh, so we, gave, we got little, water too. A little bit of dignity. We gave water and toys away. Yeah, you missed that. You saw us screw with the guy with the circular saw, but that guy was an asshole. That guy was an All asshole. Right. We didn't know how many people would be here. We would have brought more. We did. We did some immature things, though. I, I agree with that. Okay. We we were. Just, we're yeah, just, we did a lot yeah, of. This is know. like a. His poor way of showing dignity to people. Sorry about that, yes. Okay. Well, my, my poor way? Or, I mean, I know you have a chip on your shoulder, and I don't know you from whoever you think you're really cool, but I just, I really want to hope that we're coming to this space with some dignity and compassion for the sheer desperation that, you know, people are experiencing. Sure, I've absolutely. Back some tears. And you, back some tears. and we did bring gifts. We just, uh, you know, we, we got to do it with the scroll saw guy over there. No, the I know. Saw. Okay. He's, I just want to make sure that there's like, you know, that we like are respectful of people. Sure. No, no, I agree. We, we've been, we've been, if I know you saw the blowout over there, but we have been meeting people and shaking their hands and giving them water and food. And we've been, they've been enjoying. And I, and I must okay. say, I'm, and I apologize to, for, you know, for right. telling no, a group just, of people that he had a small penis to the guy over there. That was, I mean, that just, was ridiculous. Yeah, that's really what, that's yeah. what triggered, yeah, is, I'm sorry about is, that. So if you want to put stuff down, then we can talk and we can have an actual proper conversation. But he doesn't long. speak English, unfortunately. But yeah, we got him off the uh, He's from Peru. Habla español, entonces, señor. Mi papá es de Ecuador. Okay, so mucho gusto. Si puede parer como la cámara. Están trabajando solamente. Okay, so entonces si quiere parer como que pasó, so. Yeah. I mean, I'm immature, right? and it was a, okay. it was a, it was a ridiculous thing to do. Sorry about that. That's that's right. Nice so you. let's yeah. just put things in context. Sure. Okay, puede parer ahorita. They, Gracias. Should we go turn this bag of ice into ice? I think it's Parmesan cheese. <laughs> let's go report it to our boys over there up top. Yeah, like Bye. Buena suerte. Ciao. De nada. I love you. Nice, Leo. Thank you, officer. Appreciate it. you. Have a great day. I do, I do kind of love that. The beers and the twinkies. Oh, thank yeah, you, man. Dude, thank you. Thank you, sir. For hey, what you do, officer. The guy with the circular saw over there is a real asshole. Would you mind busting his balls, putting him under like a 15-minute arrest later on? Yeah, later on. Yeah. Break for a minute. Well, they're, they're, he thinks he's like all high and mighty because he's constructing a temporary structure. Yeah, but he isn't even using a level, dude. So it's kind of ridiculous. Yeah, he was being an asshole to us. He's got to use a level, guys. You know what I mean? He when we were when we tried to, he was following us around this camera. We said, "Hey, man, leave us alone." Well, you know, we don't go in for this kind of bullying. He bent over, pointed at his rectum, and said, "Yeah, like eat my ass." It, it, dude, it was in front of children, women. Dude, it was kind of it was ridiculous. But yeah, sorry about that, officer. Sorry to bring down bring you down with that little story. <laughs> I should not have done that. <laughs> he was in a nice mood until I <laughs> told him. The guy told me to eat his. Yeah, in in that absolutely disgusting way. <laughs> <laughs> I found this on the ground. This is either crystal meth or it's Parmesan cheese. I thought I would turn it into an authority, though. Don't touch. I have nothing to do with it, man. Yeah, I, Border Patrol would be the people to talk. To we them. heard it was yours. It actually had oh, Jay oh, Martin oh, written oh, on the back in Sharpie. I had that to buff kind of, it out. That kind of stuff. I honestly, uh, I've been watching it. I love the content. I love what you guys do. It's awesome. And uh, please keep up the good work. Sure, you brother. Really you too. Fans. You too, man. Yeah, man. Love you guys. And it's Claude, right? Your partner? Yeah. Uh, Claude. Claude. Yeah. And last thing, is there any way I can get a picture with you? Yeah, dude. Yeah, of hey, let's, uh, Leo, we should get one too with him. Yeah, we can get one too. Claude, you're the man. Thank you. Leo, you should go ask in Spanish if you, should get on, if you can get on the bus. <laughs> it's all chicks. <laughs> 
Hey, uh, hey, brother, if you need me to hop on there, you know, with, with all the ladies, they need a they need a bull to keep them in line, you know what I mean? I just wanna, I'm sorry, I just, I wanted to kind of, I wanted to, you know, help, I just wanted to help out, sir.